Halloween costumes, but I forgot to look through and see whether some of you, particularly some of you young ladies, did you get dressed up as a princess? Not this year? You did? Oh, it goes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, how about when you go to Disneyland? Did you dress up as the princesses then? No, I didn't go to Disneyland. Oh, how about Disney World? I've never been to any Never? Well, have you ever dressed up? Did you ever think about being or hope to be a princess? Think about being a princess? You're going to blow the whole sermon if you don't. See? <laughs> how about you guys? You ever think about being a prince? No. <laughs> Why would you want to be a prince or a princess anyway? What? Be dangerous to be a prince or a princess? You don't think you're attractive now? You don't want to be attractive? I'd pursue that, but I, I won't. All right. Well, I, I have some good news for you today. Anyway, you know, it's, if you were princesses or princes, that, who's your fa- who would be your father if you really were? A king. All right. And your mother, probably? All right. Now, all right. And, and what else would that mean? What kind of house would you live in? A castle. A castle. All right. Is that probably one of the better houses around? Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well... How many of you are princesses or princesses or princes? Do we have any princes or princesses? What? You are? No. Oh, you're not? No. Uh, guess what? All of you are baptized, right? In fact, many or most, if not most of you, I did. What? That mean? It does mean. Now, how does that mean that you are? What? Do you know that you all are princesses and princes? Because who's your father? And what is he? The king of kings. So if a regular king has his best house around, what do you, kind of house do you think the king of kings is going to have? A really big mansion in a really bad, good house. Do you know where the king of kings, God's mansions and house is? In heaven. Exactly. And everybody in heaven will be kings and queens. That's why we talk about So when you grow up in heaven, into heaven, that's what you'll all be, is kings and queens. Okay? Is that a good thing? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't want to be a queen. Well, you're in luck. You know why? God says in his Bible that we will all be kings. Thank you. Good answer. Right. Well, what that means is that in heaven, we will all have all that, that, that earthly kings and queens wish that they had, even though they're kings and queens, they wish that they had more. More power, more everything. But in heaven, you'll have everything. A lot, we don't know how much everything you do have. What we do know is more what you don't have. You have more, well, you have everything you need here now. But when heaven, what God says is that no more sadness, no more illness, no more pain, no more sun that just sweats us all over the place, no more hard work, as we think of it today, here. None of that sort of stuff. And and the Bible is a whole lot easier telling us what heaven is not going to be like than it is to be able to tell it what it is like. John today tells us a little bit about what God showed him in heaven, that heaven is like. You know what it's like? 
all of God's saints are gathered together with all the angels of heaven. And they're sitting in there, and they're around the throne of God, and they're singing. Because everybody has a perfect voice to sing with. Everybody loves to sing. And you know what they're singing? Holy, 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 Lord God of Sabaoth. Or, well, that's, I, I changed all the other words. I changed it. Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty. Heaven and earth are full of your glory and your majesty. That's what, that's what one of the songs that they sing. Today we had another one and that John heard and he said, I amen, blessing and glory and wisdom and thanksgiving and honor and power and might be to our God forever and ever. Amen. That's what the angels and the saints in heaven are singing to God. And someday we'll be able to join that, that chorus. Those singing in heaven. Okay? Yeah. Well, that's what we talk about today. What we're going to talk about today is we're not in heaven yet. And we have to live with each other here now. And you know what the problem with that is? We're all still sinners. See? And sometimes you're not easy to live with. Your brother told me. And sometimes you guys get along all the time though, don't you? No? And, and, and you and Gifta, I mean, it's just, all, it's just perfect harmony all the time. If so, you're not a normal family and a brother and sister. All right. So we have to, what we have to learn about is how do we live together as sinners, particularly amongst other people who don't care whether we're a saint or a sinner. They just want to take advantage of you. And if you're a saint and you claim to be a Christian, they're going to tease and make fun and maybe you know, hurt you if they can. Like our fellow Christians over in Iran, Iraq, Syria, over in the Middle East now, where the people there who are trying to take over, they don't care about our God. They don't care about that we're Christians. And they're killing them just because they're Christians. We'll talk about that a little bit the sermon day, so listen some more. Hope that that never happens here, comes here, all right? Or that you never have to be someplace where that happens to you. But, but that's what people in this world would like to do to Christians. I think it's even been said that there's some fellow Americans who would like for things like that to happen to fellow Christians. They don't like us. And although I don't think quite yet they would do that, because I don't think they think they can get away with it, but I think there are people around here that would like to do that. Okay. But anyhow, that's not for you kids to think about, all right? Because God sends his holy angels to kind of watch over you. And if it gets too bad, they'll just say, okay, time for you to go to heaven with me. All right? All right.